money to take them to school, dying just like any other person. The frontline countries, including Kenya, Ethiopia, and Djibouti, shouldn't be there. Former Somali Prime Minister Mohamed Mohamed has lived much of the last 25 years here in western New York. He says using soldiers from neighboring countries, some with old border disputes with Somalia, to fight in Somalia, hands Al Shabaab a propaganda argument for recruitment. These countries have uh, historic enemies, our historic enemies. So we are defending Somalia. That's not true. They are not defending Somalia. They don't care about Somalia. They are destroying humanity in general. What the U.S. and its allies needs to do is to build a national army that's capable to defend its government and for the people. The same sort of plan over in Iraq. Exactly, exactly. I know that now the current Somali soldiers have not been paid for four months. So how soldiers who have not been paid for four months can fight uh, against that menace, that threat.